and welcome everyone to another exciting episode of the Super Carlin Gaming Pokemon Soul Silver Randomizer Nuzlocke Challenge. Where in today's episode, I believe we are going to be heading down to Cinnabar to try and take on Blaine and claim our seventh gym badge. Yes, it's going to be great. Um, I think what's good is that I've got Gillen out front here. Gillen is actually up to level 45. So within striking distance of the other uh, team members, can probably start doing some fights herself, I think, which is great. Uh, if we have to switch out, then we switch out. But in the meantime, we'll let her lead. Won't get to benefit from the EXP share that way. One of you guys did recommend I check the Chansey in the box because uh, it was holding an item. And sometimes Chanseys can be holding lucky eggs, which are really good. They double your experience, but sadly it was only an oval stone. So no such luck there. Now before, I will I will admit I had a bit of a recording mistake before, I, before you're seeing this, where the microphone was just right over there. So I came over to Route 3 because I was like, ooh, we can catch something. And I fought this guy. He had a Parasect. We destroyed him. Uh, it was sad to see a Parasect die, but also, you know, I feel like he sort of had it coming. So, uh, let's see what's down here. Never seen it. Could it be a meteorite from space? Well, I mean, I guess. Can you get something down here? Is there like a, a thing? All right. Uh, doesn't look like it. I want to see if there's a Pokemon we can catch. Oh, hello. This guy. Hmm, I don't know what to do. Oh, yeah, the guy before this was like, don't call me youngster, call me shorts boy, which is like the most self-aware thing Pokemon has ever. It's, that's hilarious. I love that because he's the one who's like, I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. Anyway, uh, let's give this thing the old x -Skizor. Yeah, you're dead. See you later, Igglybuff. And a Raichu. So I think we're going to switch on that. Uh, and we're going to go to plant. Thundershock doesn't affect. We go dig. You trying to quick attack me? You trying to get some damage in? I mean, I would too, but I healed back up with leftovers underground. Oh, you got the paralysis. Yes, yeah, sneaky, sneaky Raichu. That's okay. You know what? Because I have a full heal, and I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna let plants sit there and be paralyzed. I don't like a paralyzed plant. That's no good. That's no good to me. I can run like the wind. Ride like the wind, bullseye. All right. A slacking. Well, well, well. This is indeed tricky, isn't it? Uh, these things can hit hard, for sure, but we are higher level and we do have higher defense. I don't know if we go first or second, uh, or if it what it does first, if it slacks first. We're just gonna use iron defense right out of the gauge. Counter, oh, sneaky. Okay, so now it's going to use, now it'll have truant, so it won't attack this turn, which means we can actually iron defense again pretty freely. Actually, if it's going to be using counter, maybe we should be iron defensing on its attack turns and we'll just X scissor on the turns in between, right? Yeah, it's loafing around. We use X scissor and now we'll use iron defense. Oh, it's swaggering us. I thought it was going to use counter. That's annoying. Of course, we've improved our um, defense four times. And so even if we hit ourselves, it shouldn't do much damage. So we're just going to X scissor here. Hopefully we don't hit ourselves. We do, that's a bummer. Um, now we use iron defense. Covet, not very effective. Don't use iron defense. Yeah, so we have massive high defense now. It should be maxed out. Snapping out of confusion. x or thanks for the attack boost, friend. We are sitting pretty gillin to 46. Pure ugly, pure ugly going down, going Downtown X. Oh, more swagger. Are you serious? Hit it. Yes. That's plus six to defense and plus four to attack at the moment. And Dark Rye. Of course. Why wouldn't you have Dark Rye? You know? Why wouldn't you? Um, if we hit it, I'm pretty sure it's going down, but I don't know what it has. Like, we have high defense. I think it probably has high special. Attack, I like, I so badly just want to hit this thing, but I don't like being confused and I don't want to risk Gillen. Ah, uh, it's so frustrating. We're gonna switch, we're gonna switch. I know, it's it's so sad. We're gonna go to Ace to fight this Darkrai because we don't want, we don't want anything to happen. We don't want anything to happen to Gillen. Let's not be risky and have, oh, you, all these, what? Bad dreams. I don't like that one bit. Dragon Pulse, faint attack, uh-huh. Tormented by bad dreams. This is terrible. Wake up. Faint attack. Now we get hit by bad dreams. 
Well, I don't like this one bit. We're going to go ahead and just go full restore on this because that'll heal the status and the health. Freaking Darkrai. Man, nightmare. Oh, you tried to get sneaky, but we Dragon Pulse you to death. And is Ace going to hit level 50? It's about time. Refresh. What does this do? I think this... The user rests to cure itself from poisoning, burn, or paralysis. Um, I don't see that being better than the attacks we have. Give up on refresh, did not learn it. Yeah, okay. Had to be. Had to be. Sort of where we're at. We want an. Uh, we want a Pokemon for Route 3. This is a catchable Pokemon. What's it going to be? A Vespaquen! That's cool! That's pretty cool. Um, we're gonna go Quick Ball on it, because why not? I like Vespaquid. It's very hard to get Vespaquid because you can only evolve female Combi, and they're pretty rare. Oh, come on! Just as if. All right, so not a huge problem. We're still just gonna go Ultra Ball on this thing. Level five, get in the ball. Oh, come on, man. Oh, our evasiveness fell, did it? Oh, whoops. I don't think that's gonna be a huge problem. Ultra Ball, go! Just catch it! Oh, come on! This is so annoying. It's so annoying. Just catch it! You match the color scheme and everything, Vespa Quinn. Get in the ball, one. Oh, this is such nonsense. Because we don't have... I, sh I, I swear, I should have just kept False Swipe. This is... It's so annoying. Ice, get out here. Poison sink. Give it the old burn. No. You burn it. Not, not get poisoned. We should still be good, I think. Uh, we're just going to keep confused. It's confused. Hurt itself. That's fantastic. We're hurt by poison. Yeah. Great. Confused. Sweet scent. Can't dodge. Are we taking, like... Are we, like, losing the... Yeah. Hurt yourself. This, this thing is doing so much damage to us for a level 5 best, best Bespequin. Go, Ultra Ball. Just get caught. Why is it... The poison is doing so much. It should not be doing that much. Right? Uh, very annoying. Not gonna matter. We're just gonna do this. I don't need to sit here and take poison damage and potentially die to a Bespequin. Hit yourself, Vespa Quinn. Ultra Ball, go! Just catch it. This is so annoying. Like, come on. How is it dodging this so well? It's level five! Oh, wow. Well, you just keep hitting yourself. That's fine with me. You're getting in this ball. We're gonna catch it. it clearly doesn't want to be a part of our team. What? What the what, though? Just knock yourself out at this point. I don't even care. We're, I mean, we've already got an amazing bug Pokemon on the team anyway, Vespa Quinn. What is happening, though? This is the most... Like, it's level 5. Is the catch rate on Vespa Quinn this low? What is happening? We're at a confused race. Our only hope is that it just gets caught naturally or that it burns itself. Thank you. Goodness, what a freaking waster. Ugh. I mean, it's got good typing, bug flying. You know, that's, you know, we'll give you a nickname. Oh my gosh, I'm not giving you a nice nickname. I don't know. I don't know. Not my favorite uh, way that's ever shook down before. Let's see. Uh, boom. Kraken. Kraken the Vespaquin. That's named after Knuckle Kraken. That's a pretty funny name. Knuckle Kraken. I get it. I get it. Uh, we need to probably buy some more Ultra Balls, I reckon. Ooh, an item. A big root! That's pretty solid, I, I reckon, as well. Oh boy, what else could we have caught? Hariyama! Yeah, we've had one of you before. You were pretty solid, no doubt. Ah, the weather's as fine as ever. Well, yeah, I guess. A Skarmory! Well, 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 well. You know who'd be good at fighting this? Is one Ice Ice Baby. Ice to meet you, Skarmory! Yeah, see you later, dude, you big metal bird. A Heatmon Lee! You know what we're gonna do with this? We're gonna bring in Kimberly for the Wimberly. 
Throw the Intimidate. Mind Reader. Yeah, I'm not that concerned about that. We're just going to fly high and rain death from the sky on Eatmon Lee there. I mean, Kimberly's just so good against everything. It's just, it's unfair to the opponents. It's fine with me, because that means it's really fair for us. And I like being on the side of fair. We need to go buy more Pokeballs. So, oh no, are we going to be stuck fighting these people now? Who are we going to send out? We're going to send out, just because I can get the double Intimidate, we're going to send out Kimberly with Gillen here and fight these doubles. Really? You want to battle us? You've got a lot of courage for someone so young. Huh? You'd like to go up against us. Great. All right. Well, let's just see what happens. We'll just see what happens. Explode and Tentacruel. I think we made the right call. Um, let's see. So we're pretty solid. I'm going to go Iron Defense here just to like... Just to inc improve our odds a little bit here. Um, iron defense on Gillen. And then we're going to go... We're going to go fly in case they aimed for us. So we can just um, try to take down this Exploud. Barrier. Oh, interesting. Wow. I, we had the same idea. Oh, they... They predicted. They predicted the defense boost on us. They are like, we'll boost ours, lower theirs. Well, that was interesting. I'm just going to... Redo it? Why not? Go ahead. Fly. Oh, and Kimberly destroys. Barrier again. And we use Iron Defense. Now you're screwed. Now we're going to go X Scissor on you. And we're going to go Dragon Claw on you. Dragon Claw. Water Pulse. Yikes, that hurt. Okay, don't like that. Um... Nah, we're just going to switch because there's no real reason to take this damage unnecessarily. We're going to bring in Big Rutana. And we're also going to Dragon Claw this thing. Just trying to get Gillen as much experience as we can. We're going to go Psychic on this thing. And we're going to go Dragon Claw, which is probably just going to do it. I think Kimberly ended up doing all of the work there. Minus that one little Metal Claw. Those guys have a lot of money. Jeez. Sorry, not sorry. I'm going to go spend some of it. See ya. We're going to get more Ultra Balls, obviously, because we just ran out of a thousand. Uh, yeah, that's good. And then let's go over here. We're going to buy yeah, Quick Balls because we ran out of a bunch of those, too. Nest Ball. On weaker Pokemon in the wild, honestly. We've been up against so many weak Pokemon. That might be the thing to do. Maybe we should be using this. I've never... I've always wondered, like, why would you need Nest Balls, like on easy to catch Pokemon. It's like, this is the problem. All of our Pokemon are too high level. Um, my bag is digging into my shoulders. When that happens, I like to take a break and have a battle. All right, cool. A Stami. Oh no, I didn't heal. Why didn't I heal? Oh man, that's annoying. Um, I'll just do it now, I guess. I should have done it. Now I'm just gonna end up wasting an item, but it's okay. We'll just do it here. Let's see what they hit us with. Confuse Ray. Yeah, I figured. Okay, that's fine. Um... Let's bring in... I don't want to deal with the Confuser. We're going to bring in Rutana. Swift! Well, well, well. Shadow Ball! Yes, Rutana. Crushing it. And a Steelix. Okay, so there's that. That's a thing that's happening right now. Let's go with a Psychic. Really high regular defense. Really bad special defense. Dragon Breath. Okay, pretty solid move. Going for the Paralysis. Okay. Oh. Mm-hmm. Not gonna matter because Rutana wrecks you, dude. Yes. Oh, there's another. And a Cresselia. Ooh, okay. Okay. Let's go for the Shadow Ball. Safeguard. Okay. Paralyzed and can't move. Don't love that. Mist. Became shrouded in mist. Still paralyzed. That seems pretty unlikely. There we go. Super effective. Let's get out of this paralysis. That Aurora Beam is just nothing. Yeah, we're just going to destroy this thing. Cresselia, really cool Pokemon. Love that. Love the design on Cresselia, like the moon shape. Gillen up to 48. So many levels. All right. Um, what do we need? We need a full heal. On Man, when I was a kid, it confused the heck out of me that full heal didn't just fully heal your team. Or fully heal the Pokemon. I was like, why isn't this restoring HP? It says full heal right there. I don't get it. Now I get it. Uh, X's are on this thing. Dead. Boom. Well done, Gillen. Well done. One shot, one kill. Oh my gosh, there are so many. Wait a moment. Come fight us. All right. 
What if you got a Don fan? Um, yeah, that's actually not a good matchup for us. So what we're going to do is bring in... Who should we bring in on this? This thing's what, ground type? So we're just going to bring in our flyer here. Man, having fly is... So, I mean, just having a, a fly... I can't even tell you how useful flying types are. It's insane. Scary face again. So we are like three... We're like as slow as we can be. <laughs> a bell sprout. Okay. Our ability is suppressed. Oh no, now we can't intimidate things. Are you not intimidated by our dragon now? Is that what I'm hearing? Curse! Well, you're just still dead, dude. Look at that. Destruction. Are we on a new route or is it still route three? Right? Yeah, still route three. So this is not a new catch yet. We've made this mistake once before. Oh, this guy. Hi. Step right up and take a look. I'm trying to get to Pokemon in Mountain Moon to see what we can catch in there. A Giratina! Well, 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 you rear your head again, don't you? All right, well, there's only one answer for this. This is the fight we've been waiting for. Bring in the ace. Dragon Claw, yeah, not concerned. You want dragon power? I got your dragon power right here, friend. Earth power, yeah, that could hurt, but it doesn't. And then we destroy you. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. You have the devil, we have God. What do you say to that? Oh, this guy's got all sorts of nasty stuff. Lots of ghost types. It's no big deal. We Dragon Pulse. Payback. I always think that is going to be like double what you just did. It's not counter, but in my head, it's counter. And I'm like, we're about to die. We're about to die. We're about to be killed by this Gengar. And now we're going to heal. Yeah, let's heal. We're going to Mount Moon. And we're going to just catch something. And then we're going <laughs> to we're gonna just go uh, try and find Blaine. Mount Moon. Oh, look, the little... Oh, no! What is this? Is this a... Celery! What are you doing here, you piece of rotten vegetables? Wow. Are, my, about, are we about to have fun? I did not know this was... Mm, some of the trainers here are tough, which makes it easy to train my Pokemon. I know that you are strong, but I can't help... Oh, butts! I did not... This is a surprise rival battle! Oh, gosh. Yikes. I hope we are prepared. Okay, Gillen, you got this. Lugia! Holy God! Okay. Um, okay, 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 um, uh, water psychic, right? That's what this thing is. Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, celery, 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 you sneak it, the sneaky celery. Oh, God. Um, let's go Kimberly for the Wimberly, right? <laughs> rain dance. Oh, you trying to bring in, you trying to bring the rain? You trying to bring the rain on me? I'm gonna stall the rain out is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna fly. Waste the turn of the rain. Arrow blast, whoa. Okay. Oh God, what does that do? What does that do? Kimberly? I don't like this. Oh my gosh, the crit. Very dangerous. Don't like it one bit. Item, use, Kim. There we go. Okay, he's gonna use it again. Don't get that crit though. Okay, rain can use the fall. And now we're gonna hit it with... Let's continue to stall out the rain, right? I don't want it to have some crazy water move. Just stall out the arrow blasts too. Missed, rain stopped. Okay, good. There's the arrow blast. I don't know if that's like in combination with the rain. Please don't get another crit. Okay, we're good. Now we should be able to, unless he's gonna heal, but even if he does, of course he doesn't, because he doesn't care about his Pokemon. Killing her to 49. Double hit. What does that do? Is it any good at all? I doubt it. Power 35, accuracy 90? No, that's terrible. Give up on double hit. Why would anyone want that? Kimberly gets some points. Altaria. Okay. A little dragon on dragon action. No big deal, though. Kimberly's taking some damage. We don't like that. Oh, you're dragon dancing. I see how you want to play it. That's fine with me, man. I'm going to hit you where you want to go dragon. You want to play dragons? I can play dragons. You use dragon breath. Not concerned. That was a crit. Could have paralyzed us. Didn't super effective for the kill. Oh, gosh. Celery fight. What did not know? Unknown. Wow. Okay. Well, not that concerned about this. Going to give it the old hyper voice. Give it the old scream. Yes. 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 Yell at the unknown. Scream into the unknown. Oh, whoo. Oh, this is very bad. Because I can't switch. Oh, no. 
Oh no, right? I can't switch. Can I switch? Please. <gasps> All we can do is attack. All we can do is attack. Oh, we have a problem. Oh, we have a problem. Oh, it's very bad. Okay, so the first thing we need to do, for sure, is at least heal up Ace, right? Okay, we have 200 counter. Okay, so all of our attacks are special attacks. So we have to hope it doesn't use mirror code, right? That's the thing. Um, Okay, okay. X speed, X accuracy. What does this do? Prevent stat reduction. Okay, so that doesn't that doesn't help. Okay. Oh god, this is this is such a celery move. And he's used Wobbuffet to trap Ace. Okay, so let's let's um oh man, I am I am nervous. Uh let's see. That is 90, 90. Okay. This would look like the weakest attack, but it's not because um, we have the Dragon Fang on Ace. So this is actually a little bit stronger than that. So basically what we need to do, what we need to do as I think go with Earth Power, that is our best chance because that's not a stab move. Uh, Cause I don't think I, here's my concern is I don't think we can knock this thing out in one shot. That's, that's what I would like to do, but it has so much health. This is its game. That's what I would like to do is try and knock it out in one shot, but I don't think we can. Um, if that was the case, we should definitely just go for hyper voice, but I don't think that would work. Um, we are normal. It's boosted. It's like really strong. But I don't think we... So our real goal then is to not hit it for half. Well, to not hit it for 101 points of damage, right? Like, if, as long as we can hit it for less than that, we're okay because we can heal in between and then just hit it again. But so we need to make sure we don't die. So I think Earth Power is the way to go. It might also lower its special defense in which case our next attack can do even more. We really don't have any other options anyway because we can't switch out. So we have to fight. We can't use any of our battle items to like increase our special attack or anything, which would have been one way to go about it. Our, this is really our only option. We are in a bad spot here. Josh, I can't even watch. Okay, I'm gonna hit the button. This is so bad. Okay, earth power, go. Watch this, oh my gosh. Okay, counter. Okay, that's good. That's good because, okay, I think we're in a solid spot because I don't think double what it did would kill us, even if it manages to do it. So now we're gonna go Earth Power again. Oh my gosh, this is the most nerve wracking thing. Of course it's Celery. He has Lugia, he has Wobbuffet. What a complete jerk sauce. Counter, okay, so now he's screwed. Now we go for the Gusto with Hyper Voice. We screamed this thing to death, man. If this thing had used mirror coat, I would have been, I would have been paranoid. Okay, man, we dodged a serious wobble bullet right there. <laughs> what else does he have? Two more, Corsola. Okay. Um, wow. wow, leave it to Celery. He's got all sorts of weird things. You know, he's got Unknown and Corsola, but also Lugia and, uh, Mirako! <gasps> Did you see that? That's Sly Dog. That's he. He was trying to fake us out. He's like, you he thought you were fine with the Wobbuffet? Just kidding. Corsola has Mirako too. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. What a freaking sneak. We're gonna go freaking hyper motion, man. You think, oh, he's gonna do it again. He's trying to do it again. Okay, well, he's super dead now. We're going hyper voice. We are screaming this piece of coral into the next world. Wow, what's his final Pokemon? No, no, oh gosh. Okay, okay, but now you're dead. 
But now you're dead. <laughs> this Corsola! Okay, we know the last one is Lux, right? Right? Yeah. Uh, you jerk! You jerk. How dare you bring out kilometers on us? We're gonna switch to plant here. Yeah. Swagger! I know it's gonna be used dig. We'll get under. This thing is going down. And then we dig. This should be pretty effective. Pretty effective. Level 50! 50 Lux Ray. Wow. Wow. Cell sneak celery attack with the fake out Wobbuffet Corsola combo. Wow. I mean, it's crafty. My training's still not good enough. My Pokemon are so weak. It makes me frustrated. But I can feel they are getting better after each battle. <laughs> They're still too weak. You need to give them more training. I know. Stick to the dragons then. See you, Jay. Wow. Wow. What'd you think of that? Your Pokemon is looking around restlessly for something. Probably a yellow flower, if I'm not mistaken. Right? Okay, everyone heal! Oh, and now here comes the Alga. Oh, great. All right, hold on. I'm going to have to save real quick and restart the game. Looks like we're having technical difficulties. What? What a double attack, right? All right. We, okay, anyway, Jeebs... Now, we're gonna go into Mount Moon and catch something. A Dragonair! Is that so? Is that so? You guys think what I'm thinking? Hey, you guys think what I'm thinking? Because I'm just saying, it's right there. You know what I'm saying? Like, uh, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Dragonair right there. You know what I'm saying? Oh! There's no way this will work. There's no way this will work. No way. What? <laughs> you guys! We have another. It's possible, is all I'm saying. We could have another Dragonite. It could happen. We could have another Dragonite. We could, it could happen. Give a nickname to the caught Dragonair. Oh, I think I have a funny name, I think. Markle. <laughs> Do you get it? Do you get it? I think you guys got it. Your name's, oh man. Marco to the box. It's all been worth it. It's all been worth it. Oh my goodness. Should we do it though? But should we? What would we do? Who could we pot like? The team is looking so good right now. The team is looking so good right now. But also the three headed dragon could be back. It could be back. We could have Plant and Kimberly and Markle on the team. We could have God of Poke. Oh my gosh, it's it's very very tempting. It is very very tempting. Oh man, I don't know. I don't know. This this hold on. Hold the phone here for one hot second. <sighs> it's very tempting. Okay, you guys are gonna have to let me know. Should we add Markle onto the team? But if so, what do we do? Like, what? Bench Rutana? Bench Gillen? Bench Ice? Like, obviously, Kimberly and Ace and Plant. We got, like, they're all, I, it's, Ice has been here forever. Ice has a literal cannon for an arm. It is level 49, not level 10. What, le hold on. Let me see what level Dragonairs evolve. That's a crucial, that's an important thing to know. Okay, okay, so I suppose it is worth noting that Dragonair does not evolve into Dragonite until level 55. So uh, we would have to raise Markle to be stronger than literally everyone on the team before we were actually at Dragonite stage. I'm not saying I'm against or anything. I'm just saying it would take a long time is what I'm saying, you know? Like, that's the reality of the situation. Um, but, 
But also, you know, Dragonite. It's 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 worth considering. Is all I. Hmm. Hmm. We're gonna fly. We're gonna fly back to Pewter. I think we're gonna try. I don't. I don't think. Let me know. Let me know. Let's head down. In the meantime, what we're gonna do? We, did we catch something on this route? Yeah, we did. Okay, we're gonna try and just get to Viridian City real quick. We're gonna go through the forest. Oh no, now what? Oh man, I thought for a second there was gonna be some other fight there. Let's catch something here. Let's catch something. It's a reg ice! Well, 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 man! We were catching all sorts of crazy stuff today. Uh, Pokeball, quick ball go. Why not? <clears throat> yeah, why not? That's oh no, oh wait. I was like, explosion! It did two damage. Uh, so we didn't get to catch the reg ice. That's kind of a bummer. But on the flip side, uh, well, there's no flip side. We just didn't get to catch it. The flip side is that it wasn't a very strong reg ice. So there's that. Hariyama! So we are going to switch here. We're going to get Kimberly from the Wimberly. Seismic doors! Mm hmm. And we're going to go fly and we're going to destroy this thing. Oh my gosh. Probo pass. That's an interesting line. That's an interesting matchup. The steel rock. Right? Um, I don't like the idea of rock Pokemon. Not one bit. Let's go. That's not. Because my answer to Steel is typically ice, but this thing's going to have rock type attacks, which is no Gusta. This is a weird matchup. Probo Pass is a pretty solid matchup for us. Let's go. I wonder if we can hit it with Dig. Let's go plant. Rock slide. Yeah, it was going for it. I don't know if this thing has like levitate. It looks like it's levitating, but it might not. HP is full. Dig. Okay, we hit it. There we go. All right. Okay, we got it. Gillen grew to 50! Just like that. Does that mean Gillen is actually stronger? Gillen has outpaced Rutana and Ice. What are the freaking. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Very close. Man, that was fast. EXP share is strong. Um, we're going to go Kimberly here because resists fighting and water. <clears throat> Double slap, does nothing. And then we just fly for the win. Oh, we missed! And we... Oh, gosh. Double slap. How dare you? I said, how dare you? <sighs> this is very annoying. I'm just going to get full restore because it's... That'll get rid of the confusion and the sleep. But it's so... It's just an annoying... Stop it! Stop it! This thing is doing such a tremendous job of stalling out its own death with all of its dumb tactics. But in the end, it could not resist. No one can defeat Mighty Kimberlina. As ever. Okay. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. I guess you know what I'm going to do is I'm going to take... Uh, I'm going to switch the item... <coughs> that Gillen is holding Shell Bell. Metal Coat, that's funny. Ups the power of Steel-type moves. That's We could actually do that. It does have a Steel-type move. Um, big Root, Mental Root, or Leftovers is also pretty good. I might just go, I'm gonna do Leftovers for the moment. Give to Gillen, yeah, okay. Because we have Iron Defense, so we can make ourselves fairly bulky. Right. Oh, another Reg Ice. Yeah, hilarious. Oh, boy, the encounter rate in here. Really high. I'm sure there's nothing more efficient and beautiful in this world than a bug type Pokemon. Well, allow me to introduce you to my bug type Pokemon, who I'm immediately not going to have fight uh, that thing. Instead, um, do, what about, how do you feel about Dragon? I feel like Plant is a really efficient and beautiful Pokemon. And I'm going to show you up close the extreme power of Plant. Oh, a Chansey! Uh, it's st Why has this guy got level 38 stuff? It's surprising this late in the game. And Starmie. Uh, Crunch? Rapid Spin. How is it faster than us? That's surprising. We destroy it. We destroy it big time. It's so dead. 
Blue flute. I guess that's a thing. All right, hey, let's fight. Wow, that's a huge Pokemon. W what kind of trainer? What do you mean? Are you talking about? Oh, you have a huge Pokemon. I see. Uh, <clears throat> it's going down. That's for sure. We're going to go X scissor here. Double edge. That's not going to hurt. We are steel, friend. You are hit with recoil, and then we destroy you. Uh, maybe we could even spend a turn setting up here. Because I don't think this thing can hurt us very much. But it might hit us with like some weird powder. Double edge. Or I might just do that the exact same thing again. Oh, a Snorlax. Fun, 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 fun. Um, level 60 Snorlax! This guy does have big poke. A level 6? I am going to iron defense on this thing. Crunch, yeah. Okay, not very effective. Defense fell. That's hilarious. I'll just do it again. Giga Impact. Fantastic. Let's do it again! Must recharge. Yeah, okay, so that's fun. Uh, and then let's go X Scissor. Roll out! Oh boy, I don't like the look of that. No, I do not. Uh, X Scissor. Roll out again. And we should knock it out with this one. <coughs> Oh, no! Okay. But we will knock it out with this one. Man, for a second I was like, <gasps> three times the rollout. I'm kind of surprised we didn't get the straight up level off of that. That was 10 levels higher. Snorlaxes have pretty high um, experience yield, I would think. Normally, like, big, thick Pokemon like that do. Let's go X's or Crunch. Nothing. We have massive... Massive defense going. Crunch again. Sorry, afraid not, man. X scissor for the wind scissor. Gillen, there you go. That's why we like Gillen. I mean, we like Gillen for many ways. Gillen loves flowers. That's another thing. Oh, a Pidgeot. So I don't love that because it does have a bit of a. We don't have. Um. We don't really have a good. Like, rock-type attack or electric-type attack. How has that not been a problem thus far at all? I don't know. Either way, I think we're going to go to plant here. Wing attack. Yeah, it does nothing. Let's go for the Dragon Claw. And a Tailwind. That's not going to make much difference. We Dragon Claw again. That was a crit. Look how pathetic it was. It was nothing. It was nothing. All right, we may as well just keep getting experience. Welcome to Viridian Forest. Viridian Forest, the job about bug type Pokemon. All right, do you have them? You don't have bug type Pokemon, so whatever. Uh, just water in this one. So let's go Kimberly for the Winberly. Double edge, it does nothing. Uh, we Dragon Claw. We Dragon Claw for the win. You hurt yourself. And then Clefay, both of these would have been fairy types in future gens. It would have been a pretty nasty matchup for us because we don't really have like a good answer for it. This is why they needed fairies, though, because you can see the problem is that nothing is good against dragons. Like, we just wreck everyone with Kimberly. It's a very fun time all around. Okay. Speaking of which, though, Route 2, we already caught something here because it's the same route as um, on the other end of things. Oh, I don't want to fight that guy. Anyway, let me know. Should we add Markle to the team? Let me know in the comments. Should we try and give birth once more to the three-headed dragon that would be Kimberly Plant and Markle. Should we revive Megan's legacy is the question. But what to do? What to do? How could we do it? We have God of Pokemon. We have Guardian. We have Ice the giant flaming fire duck with a literal cannon for an arm. And we have Gillen, the flower loving metal praying mantis. So, I mean, it's really impossible to decide. It's very difficult to know what to do. So yeah, let me know your thoughts though. Let me know down in the towel section below. Uh, if you haven't yet, please hit that like button. Tell us about the channel a lot. Subscribe as well. That also helps. Uh, so you don't miss any future Nuzlocks. And, of course, by leaving a comment, you put your name in the pool to have a Pokemon named after you as well. And obviously, we're catching tons of Pokemon right now. So uh, go ahead and do that as well. Otherwise, until next time, 
Bye. Hey, before we go, just want to give a shout out to all of our amazing patrons over on Patreon. Abby, Mondin, Adrian, Shishitano, Afropunk, Annalena, Ort, Brad Johnson, Brianna Bouchard, Cheyenne, Dakota Ballantyne, Dana Guest, Eduardo Bravo, Emerald Phoenix, Gamer Zylia, Gregory Lee, Jacob Rosh, Jade Culture, James Buzanel, Joanna Ashcroft, Karen Choi, The Very Not Lazy, Lacey Nielsen, Lauren Alexandra, Luxpa92, Madison Wolf, Mats Frulis, Momo East, Nicole Cox, Rachel Pierce, Rashiba, Romy Osterheld, Stacy, Yale Ezer, Zane Emerson, and Z. 0412. Thank you all so much for your support on Patreon. If you would like to uh, see your name on the wall of things right here, you can head over to patreon.com slash supercarlingaming. Thanks again. Dead spork.